now, please welcome your host, Elliot Spencer. Hello and welcome to Spit It Out, a brilliant game where teams and you work together to solve mystery words issued by the man they call Mr Me. The aim of the game is always the same. School captains must guess words using the clues supplied by their clue leaders. And those clues will be created using these giant letters. I've got a D and now I've got a P. Some of them can be rotated, keep an eye on them. It's a game of skill where you're up against the clock and each other. It's problem solving, it's physical, it's like charades with huge letters. Each week on Spit It Out is a round robin with four schools competing for a place in the series grand final. As part of that round robin format today, a runner up and a winner from this week will do battle for a place in the Friday final. Let's say hello to the team captains representing the green team from Plenty Parklands. We have Alicia and Maddie. And the blue team from Benton, we have Emily and Callum. All right, let's chat. Now, your nickname is Leash. Um, let's talk about what's happened on Spit It Out this week. Uh, what, was, what happened in your first game? Um, well, we lost and now we're just ready to play this game and hope we win. OK, over to Benton. Emmy J, let's see if this story is familiar. What's your favourite sport? Basketball. What position do you play? Point guard. Who's your favourite player? Kobe Bryant. Booyah! <laughs> <laughs> and um, how did you guys do on Spit It Out this week? We won. Ooh. Looks like we've got an interesting game. Team captains, could you please move off to your podiums? It's time for our first round. It's called Head to Head. In this round, our teams have three minutes on the clock to guess as many mystery words as possible. The teams behind me, led by Julia and Grant, come down, take it in turns to construct their clues here on the clue bank. And once their clue is ready, what do they do? Both at the same time? Buzz. 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 Almost. Then both the team captains on either the green or the blue team are free to buzz in and have a guess. Team captains, does that make sense? You understand? Yes. Yep. Yeah. OK, and remember, you get one guess per clue and you get three points for every mystery word you solve correctly. Clue leaders, bunch in. Here's your first mystery word. Off you go. There are three minutes on the clock. Benton is providing the first clue. May the clues be with you. Your time starts now. Wait, just look at the first word the clue leader pulls out. B, B, B. B. So start with B. It's B. Who's going to get the first points on the board? B, E. And the letters are rolling down. Yeah. Rolling yeah. down. What? Uh, what have we got here? Beep. And beep. lock it in. Beep. We've got beef. Who's going to have a guess? Anyone going to have a guess? Passing. OK, next clue, please. Beep. beep. OK, how did you go at home? Have you called out what you think the answer would have been? Car. OK. Car's been locked in. Plenty. Horn. It's the language of cars. Correct. All right. Were you Next say mystery oh, word. There you go. Plenty Parklands is providing the next clue. Plenty Parklands has three points on the board at this stage of the game. And there are two minutes left on the clock. And Julia is organising her spelling. Where's Julia? Where are those Julia, I don't know. Okay. It's Plenty. Good work. Our team is not all good. Hey, hey. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Good calling out there. Fighter. <laughs> Karate's locked in. Plenty. A uh, kick. Kick is incorrect. Benton, you're going to have a go? Is it fighter? Fighter is incorrect. Next clue, please. We've had karate. What did they say? Karate. Karate. Might need a rotation. But we've had... Fight locked in. Anyone gonna have a go? Go, go, go? No one having a go? Passing. Next clue, please. Remember, it's always important to have a guess. You lose nothing. One minute to go now. Japan. Getting those letters. Okay. Might want to lock that in because I think we know what it means. Sensei. How are you going home? We've got karate. We've got fight. We've got 45 seconds left on the clock. Lock it in! Okay, we've got Kung. Okay, Benton. Is it wrestle? Wrestle is incorrect. Plenty, you can have a go. Sensei? Sensei is incorrect. We're getting close. Oh my God. Next clue, please. Karate, fight, Kung. We've got 30 seconds. Judo. Judo is on the board. Anyone going to have a guess? Ninja. Anyone going to have a guess? 
Benton. Is it Ninja? The Masters of Stealth. Ninja is correct. What was it? Ninja. Oh. Next mystery word. OK, off you go. You'll have to be quick. Whatever you can put on the board. That's it. Time is up. And there was no clues on the clue bank, so I'm going to keep this mystery word secret. What a round to start off with. Plenty Parklands correctly solved one mystery word, which was horn, earning themselves three points. And Benton correctly solved one mystery word. The word was ninja, earning themselves three points as well. So the scores are as good as we can get. Three plays three. It's neck and neck. There are plenty more points up for grabs when we come back with a game called Frenzy. See you on the other side. The winning school for this series will receive an NEC audiovisual package, three eco-friendly projectors, a media player for managing all your audiovisual content, and professional LCD displays to share your experiences with the whole school. Thanks to NEC Australia. to spit it out, where the current scores are. Plenty Parklands on three points, and Benton also on three points. Now let's meet the players. We'll be having a go at our next round called Frenzy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We have Patul and Tia, and we have Emily, which I can, I can call you M, and Lachlan, I can call you Lockie. Yep. Great. All right, let's talk to Plenty first. What happened last time you had to go on the Frenzy, frenzy machine? <laughs> our first time, but it was a... Close one, it was 11, and the other school was 12. Okay, and lost by two. one? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, over to Benton. Um, what happened last time for you guys? Um, we won. Oh, we hear that. I'm listening. Okay, let's refresh our memories on how we play. Each team gets 90 seconds to spell as many words as they can out of a set of 14 random letters. What you do is you drag your letters up onto the bar like so, and when you're happy with a word like that, sample, lock it in. It'll appear on the right over here. If there's an S, no plurals, steer clear of people's names. Your words must contain between four and seven letters, okay, and you can't spell them more than once. If a word is incorrect, it'll show you because it will go red. If you want to reset, go up there and the letters go home. Everyone clear on that? Yep. yep. Good. Now, you guys have got to go off and listen to some music. Have a good time. We'll see you soon. Oh, high five. I'm liking this. Now, over to you guys first. Who's going to be starting off? Me. 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 All right, me. <laughs> You've got 90 seconds on the clock. Good luck. Your time starts now. A digit. One on the board. Great. We've got feet. Badge. Badge is up there. Good work for two. Fate, excellent. Three words. Going along great here, stage. And look how fast they are switching over. One minute on the clock. Is it M? Um, no, it's L O T. Yeah. And we're in. I'm going to have to say, floating along nicely at this stage. Five words, six words, 40 seconds left on the clock. Ah, yeah. Tia likes to change her mind. Date is locked in. Mate, mate. Oh, mate. Got... Mate. We've got 30 seconds. Uh oh. Um, Seven get, words. Get, get, get Lots of talking. And we've got eight words now. Down to the last ten seconds. Uh oh. Stay, stay, S T A L E. Nine words. Nine words. Good work. We got beat, badge, bait, stage, float, gate, date, state, and stale. Nine words, one point per word. That gives you nine points. Add that onto your total. It puts you up to 12 points. Nice, nice. Let's call out Benton. Come forward. Important information for you. They found nine. Okay, who's going first? Uh, Emily. Emily? M? 
Okay, warm up your fingers, do a little bit of this stuff. Okay, 90 seconds on the clock. Good luck, your time starts now. Now, looking for your next word, Lachlan, and guide it if you need to. Okay, step is on the board, one word. Going quicker now. Three words. Oh. And one minute left. Can you see anything? Oh. Don't need to whisper him. But you do need to help each other. If your partner's lost, give him some clues. Okay. Okay. Great word. Six letters. We're up to four. And we've got 35 seconds left on the clock. Five words. Batul and Mia, uh, oh, sorry, Batul and Tia are watching along eagerly. That's because you said your name was me. Seven words. Going good here. Okay. Bags. Bags is a plural. I can't accept that. But let's just keep going. Okay. Nine seconds. That's it. Time is up. Okay, we've got step, state, pull, budget, fail, stat. Unfortunately, I can't accept bags because it's a plural. And then we've got debt. So that's seven words, seven points. Add that to your total, it puts you up to ten points. Not bad, not bad at all. I'll come into the middle, you guys come around. Okay, so after round two, Frenzy, the scores are Plenty Parklands on 12 points. Two points behind on ten, not much in it at all. When you consider that there are potentially 12 points up for grabs when we come back and play a game called Every Second Counts. See you soon. It out. Before we begin round three, let's check those scores. Benton is on 10 points and Plenty Parklands is two points in front on 12 points. Now it's time for a game that's all about tactics. It's called Every Second Counts. In this round, there is only one mystery word to solve, but unlike other mystery words, this one increases in value every 30 seconds. Starts out being worth three points, but at the end of two minutes, it's worth 12 points. So the longer you hold off, the more points you can win. The catch is each team gets only one guess, which is why it's a game of tactics. In this round, the mystery word is always an adjective, which is a descriptive word. Team captains, are you ready? Does that make sense to you guys? Yes. yes. Okay, clue leaders. Julia, Grant, come down. Last 30 seconds. It's very important that you buzz in a what? Clue. clue. Excellent, because it gives your team captains time to guess. Let's find out what they're going to do. Plenty Park lands. Leash, Maddie, what's your plan? You're two points in front. We just want points. We don't really need, we don't really care how much points we get. We just need points. Very important. Uh, Benton, you're two points behind. What's your plan? Uh, just to hold off as long as we can. Okay, there you go. Uh, how do you feel about that, Plenty Park lands? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Come in. There is your mystery word. Off you go to your packs. There are two minutes on the clock. This time it's Benton providing the first clue. May the clues be with you. Your time starts now. Okay, clue leader, what? P. Huh? P or a D? Clue leader. It's D. D? D. Very clever. Dream. 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 Dream is locked in. Three points available at this time. Next clue, please. Describing. Are think, you waiting? Uh, You're going to keep waiting? Yeah. Yeah. yeah? I think so. Okay. All right, just checking. And I'll Three. put that one up there. We need a T. Yeah, T. Quick! Put the E in the Imagination. Six points available. T, T. No. And 
This is a great word yeah, here. Too. We've got creative. creative locked in. Six points available now. Dream and Any creative. Any ideas? Next clue, please. We've got dream. We've got creative. P. Are you still waiting? Yes, we are. They're still waiting. They're still waiting. What are you doing at home? Are you waiting? Do you know? Six points about to take over to? Nine points available. Huh? Imaginative. Imaginative. Pretend. No, imagine. Next clue, please. Three. Creative. No, we don't know what the word is. Nine points available. Both teams are waiting it out. Show them the nerve. And they've got Imaginary. Next clue, Next one. Next clue. Benton. On the next. Imagine. Imaginary. Is that an adjective? Yeah. Last 30 seconds now. Next word in the closet. 12 right. points. Right. 12 points available. Fake. Both teams are waiting it out. Plenty Parklands. Imaginative. Imaginative is incorrect. You're locked out. Benton. Is it imaginary? My best friend's imaginary. Correct. <laughs> Great work there. Let's have a look. We had dream, creative, pretend, think and fake. Plenty parklands. Very, very close there. But unfortunately, I've got to accept the correct word in that instance. Did imaginary come up in your discussions? Not once. Not once, but imaginative. You're on the right track. I could hear you two, Benton, screaming out the word imaginary to each other. How early on did you start to think it was that? Not very. Not very? Wow, what a round. How did you go at home? Were you screaming out imaginary as well? With around 16 seconds left on the clock and 12 points available, Plenty Parklands buzzed in and incorrectly guessed imaginative. They were very, very close. However, with 13 seconds left to go and 12 points available, Benton correctly guessed imaginary, scoring themselves the maximum points, 12 points. So at the end of every second count, scores are Plenty Parklands on 12 points and Benton out in front on 22. Big smiles all around. But don't worry, everyone. Everything could change because after this, it's our final round head-to-head -head with a twist. See you soon. where we're about to play our final round, The Decider. But before we do, let's check the scores. Plenty Parklands is on 12 points. And Benton is out in front on 22. Let's begin our final round. It's head-to-head -head with a twist. Once again, our teams will go head-to-head -head trying to solve as many mystery words as they can in three minutes. The twist is the first mystery word is worth 10 points. And every mystery word after that goes up by... 10 points, so it's 10, 20, 30, 40, etc. This game is not over yet. Plenty parklands. All right, clue leaders, come down. It's the big Chatsky time. Plenty parklands. Leash and Maddie, over to you first. What are you trying to do in this last round? What's your goal? What's your ambition? Um, to get as many points as we can and just guess. And win the game? Yeah. Benton? Um, what are you hoping to achieve? You're on 22. If they get the first word, though, they've caught up. Um, we're just trying to build up a chain of correct answers so we can just get further and further ahead. OK, well, I think it's time for us to play. OK, bunch in. There is your first mystery word. Off you go to the packs. Plenty is providing the first clue. There are three minutes on the clock. May the clue be with you. Your time starts now. So what's she got first? Has been locked in. Win. Have a go. Yeah. 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 Next clue, please. Love. Remember, you don't have to wait it out in this one. You've got to buzz in. Love is locked Sweet. in. Anyone gonna have a go? Plenty. Sweet. Sweet is incorrect. Benton, you're gonna have a go. Is it win? Win is incorrect. Next clue, please. Okay, we've got beat and love. I've got ten Sweet. points that I want to give away. Sweet. 
At home, you've had beaten love. What do you think? Uh, I think we're looking for... Beat and love. What was the last one? Oh, I think what it was, was pump. So, anyone have a buzz? Pump. Beat. Everyone's passing this time. That's it, pass. Love. Next clue, please. Beat, love. You've got to have a guess. Uh, blood. blood. That's blood. Plenty. Red. Red is incorrect. Benton. Is it hard? Yours will beat 2.5 billion times in your life. Hard is correct. Come on down. I've got to wait. 20 points here. Off you go. Benton is providing the first clue. I need to make it clear that you have to buzz in. About a minute and a half. You have to buzz in. Not. Mug. 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 Mug is locked in. Plenty. Coffee. Coffee is incorrect. Plenty. Tea. Tea is incorrect. Next clue, please. We've had mug. Glass. Cup. Cup. Okay. Cup. Then. Cup. then you've got to add the clues Cup. together. Buzz it is. We've had glass. Benton. Is it drink? Drink is incorrect. Cup. Those clues were there. Cup of tea. Great work. <laughs> Next mystery word. Ready, Off you go. Ready, it's 32 <laughs> plays 32. This is worth 30 points. <gasps> there is this <laughs> exclusion <laughs> coming from plenty <laughs> parklands. Uh, 30 points, 30 seconds. <laughs> Football. MCG is locked in. Benton. Is it football? It is football. <laughs> Next word. 20. All right. Okay. I'm going to get this I've one. got 40 points to give away. Next Ten. clue should be coming from they're not, Benton. They're not going to get it. Go, go. Around there, plenty Parklands correctly solved one mystery word, which was cup, earning themselves 20 points. Great work. And Benton correctly solved two mystery words, which were heart and football, based on one clue, which was MCG, earning themselves 40 points. Great work. I think we have a winner. What an afternoon we've had here on Spit It Out. At the end of four fantastic rounds of Spit It Out, with a total of 32 points, today's runner-up is Plenty Parklands. Which means, with a total of 62 points, today's winner is Benton. Congratulations. Now it's time for us to acknowledge some brilliant competitors here this week on Spit It Out. Great work to Alicia and Maddie representing their school, Plenty Parklands. Let's also acknowledge some brilliant clue leaders today. Julia, excellent communication, lots of yelling out to her spellers, and Grant. Yeah. Always excited, always pumped. And to Benton we say, congratulations. You've earned yourself a place in the Friday final. How about a little bit of a shake hands? Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Thank you to you and everyone else who helped out and spit it out this afternoon. We'll be here tomorrow, same time, same place, but with a whole new stack of mystery words. Bye for now, not forever. Go to the cubes. You have my permission.